Hi guys, it's me, the Master Three One Six, and I'm going to be playing Bloons Tower Defense Five. So it's a game I've had on my phone uh, for quite a while. It's just um, I didn't think I'd do a video on it, but um, my last video I got to round one hundred and fourteen, and I just thought maybe I'd start making some. So let us do a game. So I've done quite a few already, as you can see. So I've got majority of the bronze for all of them, um, mainly for beginner, intermediate, and I've done some on advanced, expert, and extreme, and I've done some silver. So let's see if we can just start off easy, and if you guys like it, then maybe I'll do a harder one or more of these videos. So I'm going to do it without fast track, so um, you guys can see the full gameplay. So I normally start off with putting a few dark monkeys and this rate I'll only put one and normally I just put it on double the speed. So let's increase the range slightly just in case they do go on the side. Oh maybe I'll have to do it again. Yeah, so just in case they get over there. I should have really put that somewhere else, but never mind. So obviously that didn't go as well as I hoped, so let me just put one there. Yeah, okay, that was good. So maybe I need to restructure this. So maybe sell that, put this closer on that side, increase the range, and make these do double the damage. And then I just keep upgrading, upgrading the... Um, bottom ones I should really change this so it is continuous so let's make that triple that one I still need to upgrade I'll do that now let's wait for this one Almost there. Yep, done it. Okay, so now we've set up the base. That should last us for quite a while. Um, I'd say maybe a glue gunner. Let's find out. A good position, I'd say. Um, not too sure. I'd probably suggest here. At least it covers a bit of that, um, which I suppose is good. Let's put corrosive. Um, so yeah. Let's put this for the strongest ones. I could either put a new one there, or I could just put another monkey. Um, I think the best idea would be... What would it be? Because if I put that there, then at least it will slow down slower ones. I think maybe I'll do that. Not that. That. Okay, so let's put corrosive glue on that. And let's put that for the faster ones. So strong. There you go. So as you can see, it's doing a lot more damage here. Maybe again, we'll put another dark monkey, I guess, to support this one. Uh, let's enhance the eyesights uh, just as I was about to say it there so now the camo balloons are coming they're ones that can't be seen by towers unless you upgraded them unless uh, you are the ninja monkey that's the only one that can see them without I believe the other ones you need to upgrade so on wave 28 out of 65 so we're we're doing pretty well so far I guess Let's put in this, let's target that for strong, let's increase this, cluster bomb definitely, so that will do a lot of damage around here. Now we can wait, um, this isn't normally a setup I use, because normally I put in the monkey apprentices, um, so let's see where I can put it. 
I'll put it to the start for now because what I normally do is I normally get the lightning bolt and once I do that kind of takes care of the whole roll and if you put a few more in then that will cover a large range because they normally just take out what's in the roll with lightning bolt and um, that will cause a lot of them to um, pop so let me show you if I can so if I put a few more here maybe then you'll see that they might not get above here unless they're in the higher rounds so that one will reach yep we need to get that much let's sell that one um, Are these ones upgraded? Yes. So I'm trying to show that these are like the best option to use. Because if you can see, they're not really getting any far except for this part. So I need to put a few more super, not super monkeys, um, apprentices. Um, that I can need this, I don't really need anymore. Um, yeah, let's put that here. Upgrade this. And right now we can really wait, I guess. Because, um, okay, I kind of made a big mistake. Okay, that wasn't a good one. Okay, never mind. Okay, that was a big mistake right there. I shouldn't have done that. But as you can see, I've got enough tax to cover up. Um... So what I've done wrong is that I focus them all on this part because in this map it's not a good idea because they can't reach up there. Um, so what I might do is I might put more focus around this area in case they do get this far. Because Moabs aren't um, affected too much by the wizards. So I need to kind of counteract that with something else. So let's upgrade that. Let's sell this. Uh, let's put this instead. I know it's the same thing, but I'll go with the different upgrades. Oh, that's the one thing I don't like. Oh, oh. Let's put that instead. Since we got almost two of them, that would definitely stop any Moabs. Um... Okay, so I think I know what to do. Let's focus on pushing these ones back. Yeah, so you can see it did too much damage to them. So let's upgrade this. So that would definitely slow them down when they get around here. So this is going um, kind of better than I thought. So let's see what else I can do. So let's sell this for now. And um, let's just keep pushing them back. The more I can push them back. Okay, this I don't really need. Um, I can sell that. Okay, so I want to put this somewhere. Do I have space? Yes, I do. Okay, good. Um, let's increase this. So the f what I normally do is I normally put the village tower where the majority of them are. So this one I might need to extend a bit. So what I just did was I increased the popping power and increased their radius. And now I am going to increase um, how fast they attack. So they can already see the balloon, so I'm not going to bother with that. So that's not too bad. Maybe I'll put another village. Where can I put it? I can't really suit that. Um, where do I see a spot? They almost it's a bit of a problem sorry guys there you go extend the range now that would definitely help out also with the um, village it gives you like a 10% discount I should say on everything in the radius so normally this would cost about 5k 
maybe just a bit greater. Maybe we should put in another one, I guess. Um, where should I put this? I don't really need to focus it around this area. I can focus it primarily at the beginning, but I want to keep its range extended. So I'll put that there <clears throat> and extend this so it covers this part of the map as well. <clears throat> so let's carry on. So at the moment, I don't really need to focus on the game or do anything because I have got it all mainly sorted out. <clears throat> so yeah, I can just leave it running for the next few waves and I'll win. But in case I'm wrong, we need to do some final upgrades. So let's increase that. So yeah, we're on the final wave now. Let's just buy that, because I don't really need anything else. And in case there is camel balloons, at least this and that can not find it. And we're done. So I've got silver, $125, and two tokens. So I am probably going to spend those tokens now. If you guys like this, then rate it, and um, I'll upload more on this. So let's go to the monkey lab. What do I need? So I've quite I've upgraded quite this quite a bit. Um, not too much though because it is hard to get tokens because I don't buy them. Let's do this ability cooldown because um, it reduces the cool time, cooldown time of abilities. And as you saw on my previous video, that's what I kind of needed. So um, for the monkeys, I had this specialty on. So Mage Spire, so um, level 1 reduces cost, level 2 increases range, 3, this is what I'm trying to save up for, um, and that does that, so that's good. So what I've maxed out already is this one, so Spikes are us, so reduces cost, um, increases spike lifespan, um, generates one road spike pile, and pops... 50% more. So guys, anyways, hope you like this video. And see you in the next one, I guess. Oh, I ranked up as well. That's good.